All right, guys, this video is on connecting Rollins. And like most of our plotters, it's, it connects a few different ways. Um, Rollins can be print to cut, they can be serial over USB or serial only. These are just, has to do with how these, you know, different models connect. Before you start this process, make sure your plotter is on, connected to the computer. It's got material in it that'll handle a 14 by 14 uh, test cut and is ready to accept a plot. So we're gonna dive in and hit add cutter. I'm gonna type in Roland here, select it. I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna print one. I'm gonna select a, a, a model that we know it is a print to cut. So, and that's this one of these here. You may find that we don't have the exact model name in there that is your plotter. There's a lot of models out there. My suggestion is pick the thing that's closest to it. Go with that first. If you still can't get it connected, give us a call. Also, if you do find that you don't have the exact, we don't have the exact plotter model in here and you do pick the closest thing and you get it connected, reach out to us and let us know exactly what your plotter model is and we can add it to our list to make sure the next guy that has maybe the same plotter you as doesn't have to guess as if you will. And when that happens, it'll pull up available devices. You go in there, find your uh, Roland, select it, and then hit send calibration plot. On any any in connection that we're doing on here, you always wanna hit cal send calibration plot. This establishes whether you have a connection or not. So make sure you have your, uh, your machine on before you're doing any of this uh, adding cutters on Eagle Cut connected with material in it to handle 14 by 14 plot and ready to receive a plot. Select that, hit send plot. If it connects, save your plotter name and you're good to go. If it's not this type of uh, plotter where it's a print to cut and you say it's a uh, PNC, uh, let's just go 1210. This would be a plotter that's a serial over USB. And what that means is it may look like it's a USB cable connecting your computer, but it's actually serial inside the machine. That's how it connects. So to find what that port is, you just go to device manager, find a folder that says ports, look in that folder, find out what port it says in there, put it in here, put, put in the manufacturer again, your model number, and it'll propagate this, send your calibration plot to, to connect and make sure you're connected. If it is a serial cable that's connecting your uh, plotter, um, one of those models might be a, well, let's see, a CX24. It's the same kind of thing. You're gonna select the port, you're gonna go in there and it's like the manufacturer and the model and then it'll fill out the rest of this stuff for you and then you send a calibration plot to make sure you're connected. Um, Pretty easy peasy. Again, if you run into issues and it doesn't connect any of these ways, please reach out to us and we'll give you some help.